Community Link, presented by Financial Center First Credit Union. Thank you for joining us for Community Link. I'm Caroline Mays. Addressing issues that affect Indianapolis's growth and well-being, Downtown Indy focuses on advancing downtown as a great and diverse place to live, work, and play. Joining Community Link is Taylor Schaefer, President and CEO of Downtown Indy. Taylor, welcome. Thank you for having me. And congratulations on your new role. Thank you. Yes, you just left um, a great position as Deputy Mayor. Tell us why this position at Downtown Indy was so important for you to take. Well, I mean, first of all, it's personal for me. I grew up in Terre Haute, and downtown Indianapolis was always the place to go for field trips. It was the place to go for back-to-school shopping. It was the place to celebrate the holidays. And I know for so much of central Indiana, that's what downtown is. It is a destination. It is the front door. And right now, both as we're thinking about this sort of post-pandemic era and as we're thinking about the incredible opportunities in and around our downtown, it just seemed like a really exciting opportunity that I wanted to be a part of. So we understand that downtown Indianapolis is important to the city. How important is it to central Indiana and to Indiana in general or to the nation? No, absolutely. I, it, downtown Indianapolis is about 1.3 square miles and yet represents about 20 percent of the income for the city and county. It continues to be both an economic driver for central Indiana and the state, as well as truly the, the way that people are welcomed into the city and our community. I think there are so many people whose first impression of Indianapolis and Indiana is through our downtown, which means that that is both a, a really uh, important responsibility, but also a really exciting one in terms of how we can make the best impression for the people who live there, for the people of central Indiana, and for people all around the world who may be visiting our community. We hear some great things about downtown Indianapolis, but we also hear about some challenges. What are some of the issues that you hear or see and that you want to tackle, want to make sure that you tackle. And how do you plan to tackle them? Sure. I think, uh, as with any downtown in, across the country, I think safety, I think cleanliness, and I think the perceptions of safety continue to be really a key priority for downtown Indianapolis. And thinking about how we can ensure that everyone feels welcome in that space, but also how people can have that best possible experience. For the last several years, downtown Indianapolis has utilized uh, a group of employees from HVAC that work as street ambassadors, helping to do cleanup, helping to do graffiti remediation, helping to ensure that when someone visits here, their impression of downtown is a clean, wonderful place. We also work really closely with IMPD and with a team of non Warren safety ambassadors that act as that intermediary between businesses, between those that may be experiencing our downtown and living in our downtown, and uh, just to ensure that those lines of communication are open and that we're really prioritizing ensuring that everyone has a safe experience as possible. What would you say to those who might be nervous about coming downtown? I think, I think the holidays, which are right around the corner, present maybe one of the best opportunities to uh, reintroduce yourself to downtown. The, there are so many wonderful things that occur from the circle of lights to uh, our partners at IRT, uh, our partners in so many of our arts institutions that really give one-of-a-kind holiday experiences that can't be found anywhere else in central Indiana. And so I know that everyone is really focused on putting their best foot forward and making that as hospitable of an experience as possible. And so maybe as they're thinking about their holiday plans, that's the perfect time to reintroduce themselves to downtown. And they're right around the corner. They're right around the corner. Thank you so much, Taylor, and congratulations. Best wishes on your Thank new you role. so much. Yes. Thank you for joining us for this week's Community Link. To share this story or learn more, head to wishtv.com. We'll see you next week.